Hey guys, welcome to Planning with Crystal. So today's unboxing is the NARS Undress Code Lip Balm Set. So I'm gonna show you everything that comes in this new holiday 2020 set. And I'm gonna try all the lip colors on for you so you can see what you think and whether you wanna pick this up. So this recently went on sale in the UK for 32 pounds which is actually a really good deal for this because inside you get a full size of the lip balm, a three gram size, and these retail at 23 pounds on their own. So for an extra nine pounds, you're getting three mini NARS lip balms. So I actually think this will sell really well because it's such a good deal. I've been eyeing up the NARS lip balms for quite a while because I'm a bit of a lip balm obsessive. I love wearing lipsticks and things, but particularly with lockdown and wearing masks and things, lip balms are obviously a lot easier to wear um, than putting lipsticks on that are gonna transfer everywhere. But what stopped me buying these lip balms previously is I couldn't really decide which colour to go for. So this is perfect because you get a range of colours in this set. So first of all, the full size is in their best selling shade, Orgasm. And it's probably the most wearable of all of the colours. So this is Orgasm. Then we've got a mini in Fast Lane and all of the minis are in a 1.1 gram size. You can also pick up these minis in a lot of the other NARS holiday sets paired up with either two little mini lip balms, they retail at about £20, or one mini lip balm with one mini blush, they're about £20 as well. So Fastlane is rather like Orgasm, they're very similar kind of shades to each other and you can see that in the swatches as well. Then we've got Dolce Vita. So I quite like this one, this one's a little bit more pigmented, this is probably my favourite one so far. And then finally Laguna, so kind of named after their famous bronzer, so I'm expecting this one to be a bit more kind of bronzy tone. Laguna hasn't really got that much colour coming through. Um, these two shades, Fast Lane and Laguna, the packaging kind of surprised me because they look like they're going to be super dark, you know, if you judge it based on the colour of the packaging. Whereas with these, you kind of know what you're getting because they are a little bit more pinky. Although this one sort of looks like it's going to be a bright raspberry pink and it isn't really that bright. So in terms of the way they feel on the lips, they feel like a really kind of moisturising balm. They don't feel waxy, they don't feel um, like they're going to be sticky or anything else like that. 
They're obviously not a matte colour and they're not intended to kind of last all day, so they are going to wear off, especially if you're eating and things like that. I do think if you're wearing a mask, you're probably going to get a little bit of transfer on the inside of your mask as well. But if you're just looking for a nice kind of working from home, staying at home um, kind of look, or a bit more of a pared down makeup look, then I think these would be perfect. I also think they'd be great for somebody who loves makeup who isn't necessarily as adventurous because they are all very wearable and you have to love the NARS packaging. They are all in this like metallic packaging with NARS going around it. If you like line them all up together like that, you can actually make out the whole kind of NARS logo together, which is quite cool. Um, so these would be an amazing gift, but I love them for myself just to be able to try more of the kind of lip balm range. So let me know in the comments, what do you think of the NARS lip balms? Have you tried them? If so, which shades do you like? Um, and did you enjoy this video? This is a little different for me actually doing a video just about products and obviously I test a lot of products so if you would like to see more videos like me trying on lots of different lipsticks I have quite a collection so if you'd like to see something like that let me know in the comments. If you're still on the hunt for the perfect advent calendar check out my advent calendar playlist. I'll put it here and you can go and check that out. There's over 50 um, 2020 beauty advent calendars and other types of advent calendars on there. And if you've enjoyed watching this video, I'd love it if you give me a thumbs up. It lets me know you're enjoying the content I'm producing. And I'd love it if you'd subscribe and hit the notification bell to be notified when my next video goes live. So I'll put some links underneath the video of where you can pick this up in the UK because I actually managed to get it on a bit of a deal on Debenhams. I got like an extra 10% off and the deals are always changing on all the different websites. So I'll see everywhere that I can find it on sale right now. I'll link them underneath and then you can choose which is the best option for you if you're looking to pick it up. So thank you so much for watching. Bye guys.